What's up legends, I've just got enough samples to unlock the enhanced combustion and I have just got to put this bad boy to the test. So as we can see here, I just finished off farming some samples and where are you? There you are. Fire damage from stratagems increased by 25%. That's the napalm, incendiary mines and the flamethrower. I'm super excited about this. Let me go ahead and bring this onto the field and let's just see how much of a difference this is going to make. Uh, we're going to be playing a game here going for as many kills as I possibly can, of course, while attempting to win as well. Let me bring here a uh, proper mission type. What this will do? An egg mission. Orbital scatter. We're not going to be bringing any orbitals, so that's kind of a wasted modifier. So that's pretty good for us. And for stratagems here, we're going to be bringing the usual best. Uh, I think I want to land in the middle of the eggs, maybe. We're going to be playing hyper, hyper aggressive like you've never seen before. Um, uh, you know what? I'm actually going to spawn on the extraction zone and make my way up north. 500 kilo, of course. The shoe generator, flamethrower, and of course, the napalm airstrike. Uh, that's pretty good. We're also going to be bringing the stamina enhancement here for the most movement and for equipment. Uh, I got to change out of the grenade pistol just for this video. The impact is fine. And the breaker. You see, I think I'm just going to stick with the breaker rather than the breaker incendiary because I'm afraid that the breaker incendiary will override the flamethrower damage. Like, I'm afraid that if I light an enemy on fire with the breaker incendiary, that fire damage will override the flamethrower dot damage. You know what I'm talking about? Maybe uh, this kind of needs to be tested, but since this is just like pretty much a first impressions of this ship module, I kind of don't want to find out right now. So we'll play it safe and stick with the breaker here. We're going to be calling in flamethrower shield generator pack, and it's time to play hyper aggressive. Also leave a resupply here for when we make our way back. So we're going to be bum rushing the main missions as fast as I can to kind of manipulate the patrol spawns a little bit to kind of uh, get them to spawn more often, as well as we'll also be trying to do a couple of bug nests to really force the game to spawn more and more patrols. In case you didn't know, if you get rid of the main mission as well as a couple of bug nests, you do speed up the patrol spawns a lot more, and that's exactly what we want. Throwing in a fat napalm here. Hopefully that'll land right in the middle of them. Let's see how much damage that's going to do. I think that kind of missed a little bit, though. Still going, though. Let's go, baby. Come here. Oh, that is clean, dude. That is clean. That's a very fast kill. Come here. The other charger. I want to test it on you. Oh my god, bro. Look how fast the flamethrower are killing charges nowadays. <laughs> Another one. All right. All right. Come here. Come on. Jesus. So powerful, dude. Holy shit. Three fucking charges down in just a couple of seconds. Let's go. Burn them all down. Quick tip, in case you didn't know, it does matter, I've, I've said this before in other flamethrower videos, but in case you didn't see, it does matter where you aim with the flamethrower. Don't just light the enemy on fire and call it a day. It actually matters where you're aiming with the flamethrower, okay? So focus on the weak spots when you're firing your flamethrower for maximum damage. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Got a big old boy there. See if I can make it in here. Pop a few eggs. I want to get moving to the next objective already. Don't want to waste too much time. My focus here is going to be to get these missions done as fast as I can. These objectives, rather. Excuse me, sir. Thank you. Did I get the eggs? No. Nope. Okay, that did it. Oh, shit. I almost died. Down goes the charger. We don't want bio titans. We don't want these. See if we can one hit it. No, that's pretty bad. Oh, he walked way past it. Oh, 
What the hell? Okay. All right. Really didn't think that was going to do it. We're going to be playing hyper aggressive here. You guys that uh, enjoy learning from watching the gameplay, don't take what I'm doing here to the heart because I'm just going to be shooting at everybody. Okay. It's not recommended you do that. But yeah, I'm going to be shooting literally everything I see on site. You'll try not to take this home and actually apply it to your games because it's not going to be very good. Also, we are going for like the most kills I can get here. But I will say uh, kills do not matter, guys. I honestly just do it for fun. Kills do not matter at all a lot of people commenting in my other videos with a high kill saying why are you getting kills you don't actually gain anything from it and honestly i just do it for fun i think it's fun so that's that we also want to toggle here as many bug breaches as i can so ideally i don't want to always kill every bug i want to leave a bug here and there alive so that they can call in for bug breaches. I want them to call for as many reinforcements as possible. Here we go. It's beautiful. Like the best time to use napalm right here. We'll have to throw this 500 kilo just to kind of ego rearm uh, so we can get our napalms back as they are going to be our main source of damage for the little guys. They are just an absolute monster, dude. The fire damage right now is just so out of control. Look at this. They can't even come close to me unless they charge me like that. <laughs> just so powerful right now. It's insane. I think it, it probably right oh probably right now is one of the best ways to deal with chargers. It's just killing them so fast. I mean the quasar cannon is probably gonna be the most effective still because you just one hit them, but the flamethrower isn't just a charger killing weapon, right? You can actually do it for the medium guys, small guys, the bigger guys. The only thing it's not that useful against is going to be the uh, Bile Titans. Of course, I'm speaking about Terminid here, not both factions. Push here for the eggs. Excuse me, guys. Don't mind me. Oh, what? Holy shit. Did not expect that turn. <laughs> I did not expect that at all. Let me land on them, get my stuff back. It'll be a bit dangerous, though. My back is against the wall. That'll do. Oh, I thought you died. God damn it. Shit. Gotta get my stuff back before I get overwhelmed here. Okay, we got the shield at least. Let's just see you three guys. Alright. Get my stuff then. Leave that hive guard alone so he calls for backup. Come away, dude. You're gonna end up killing me while I'm picking up the sample, so might as well not risk it. Ideally, leave at least like one guy al alive here. So that they possibly call for reinforcement. All right, we're seven minutes and 30 into this game. We've done the vast majority of the main objectives. Just one more to go. Let me make my way there real quick. Oh, man, it's unbelievable. It's beautiful right now. Holy shit. I totally recommend getting this. Uh, this ship module upgrade. Holy crap. For first impressions, I am absolutely loving it. 
It is just melting these bugs, dude. We got a shrieker nest there. Not, uh, not ideal. That's going to delay our time quite a bit and not give us many kills for it. So I'm going to try to make my way there first. I think I want to 500 kilo them rather than hell bomb. Kilo should do it. That's pretty solid, isn't it? Let's find out. No, that's only gonna get the. Ah, oh, I didn't even get two. It only got one. Oh crap! Please don't miss this 500 kilos, so I don't have to go up there. I'd land this perfectly. Maybe if I bounce it. Mm, I think that's bad, dude. Let's see. Oh, okay, beautiful, beautiful. That's gonna save us like. Two minutes or so. I'm gonna try and bring all this threat. Oh, there's people behind me. Okay. Kinda wanna bring them towards the eggs. I can start working on. Oh shit. Start working on that. Dude, I cannot wait for a flame resistant uh, armor set right now. Napalm airstrike. Pretty mediocre napalm airstrike. Usually they're a lot better than that. I kind of missed that. It seems like. Oh, hello, big boy. Don't mind me. Okay, make them hit this rock. Three of them. Oh shit. All right, you know what? I gotta make my way to the resupply as I'm out of stims. Go, go, go. We got the eggs here. Kind of really want to go pop them. We can finish off this main mission, but let me get rid of these charges first. Clip them here. A little you, big boy. Oh shit. Keep lighting myself on fire. One more here. Shoot its right leg. Well. Go, beautiful. A bug breach. Napalm should be pretty clean. Landing in this direction should land towards that bug breach. You can hit the rock there at the top. Kind of block my napalm a little bit. Still pretty solid though. Charges just a little bit out of range. Let's go. I wish this was a pouncer world. It would give us quite a bit more kills. But it's still going pretty solid and we should be able to complete this objective right here. Another little gang here. How'd you like the taste of freedom? Empty. You see, if my suspicion, if my fear of the breaker incendiary is wrong, then the breaker incendiary is gonna be an insane addition. Oh shit. It would definitely be a better choice than the regular breaker. I don't know if you guys kind of understood what I meant with the reason why I didn't bring the break incendiary. But what I'm afraid of is, let's say when you light an enemy on fire with a flamethrower, let's say that's going to do 100 damage over the course of 3 seconds. I'm afraid that since the breaker incendiary's fire damage is going to be doing less damage, let's say 75 damage over the course of 3 seconds, 
I'm afraid that when you light the enemy on fire with the Breaker Incendiary, that's going to be the fire damage that's active on the enemy rather than the damage from the flamethrower. <laughs> I don't know if I explained myself well, but I'm sure some people will get what I mean. All right, so we completed all primary objectives. This is going to force spawns quite a bit. 26 minutes left. That's going to spawn a shit ton of bugs. We're going to push here a couple of bug nests. Try to increase the spawn further. Force the game to spawn even more patrols against us. Oh, shit. Later on, we go into this game. The harder it's going to get by attempting this. Hopefully, we don't overwhelm ourselves. Flamethrower. Always try to get a little bit of high ground as well. That's going to help a lot. Oh, I missed that. I mean, you should really try to maintain higher ground with any weapon, but yeah, with the flamethrower. Very important. Let me see if I can clip this charger. There he goes. See ya. I'm pretty sure I'm killing chargers faster than I would if I had the quasar. That was a good 500 kilo. One more should do it. Oh shit. Oh no. Uh oh! Get up, buddy! Oh no. I think I'm dead. Him again. One. The high ground. Go, go. Oh shit. Napalm should be good though. We got two Bio Titans. Where's the other one? The other one died? Oh, the other one killed itself. Killed itself. That's funny. Didn't even realize it. Oh shit. Which, by the way, might be something you need to take into account when you're playing with this loadout. That's going to be more advanced. You're going to need to pay attention to if the 500 kilos ain't cutting it. You're going to want to pay attention to trying to get the uh, Battle Titans to kill themselves at in certain situations. We'll see if we can get that to work in this game. At least once, maybe. Show you guys what I mean. Only if the situation rises, though, as it is pretty situational. Pretty large army. Let's go. Come here, boys. I'm over here. Bring them out to the radar station here. Let's see if we can work this one out. Ooh. Hello. So much barbecue. How'd you like the taste of freedom? See, I think that, yes, I honestly didn't do that on purpose. See exactly what I meant, that, that Bio Titan killed itself there. That's the second self-kill. Because he, what happens is, hold on, I'll explain in a second. How'd you like the taste of freedom? That's a lot of freaking bugs. Dropping a pin. Kind of want to make my oh. way over there. I don't think I'm really going to concern myself too much with the radar station. I have all the information I need to know. Ah, oh, that's a lot of bugs. Always focus on the chargers and the hunters, and then you can get rid of the other guys. Never prioritize the small guys first. Unless they're a more immediate threat, of course. Yeah, what I was saying, let me see if I can say it here. 
If the Bile Titan is hugging a wall. Oh, god damn it. Maybe that's why I didn't want to talk. <laughs> the Bile Titan is hugging a wall and he tries to do the acid spit at you. And he's hugging a wall and he spits at the wall. His spit is gonna hit the wall and bounce back at him, killing itself. Okay, so it's a good idea to try to force the Bile Titan to do the spit move when they're really close to a wall. So it has to attempt to get the Bile Titan to damage itself or potentially even kill itself. That one, I, it was a complete accident. I did not do that on purpose at all. But yeah, it, it can be something that you can pay attention to. Try to force them to do the spit move as you're kind of hugging a wall and they can end up killing themselves. Oh, that napalm is going to be fat. It's going to be so good. Oh, no. Oh, he's got me. I'm dead. What the fuck? I'm not dead. I need a resupply, though. Go, 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 go. That is beautiful. Another Bile Titan. I think that 500 kill is going to be pretty good. Let's go. Oh, I thought I killed him. No, the Flamethrower can also damage the Bile Titans, but generally I don't recommend it. If this does it. Oh no. Fuck. <laughs> Since he hit me, I got ragdolled and I couldn't dive to protect myself. Well played, Bile Titan. Well played. Alright, 20 minutes left. We've killed so many freaking bugs already, dude. Try to call these bugs in without killing them, so they hopefully call a reinforcement. Another one up here. Oh, it's a big boy. Uh, it's kind of bad because they kind of kept dying there as they were calling for reinforcements. I actually didn't want them to die, but the fire killed them. Come on, one of you call for reinforcements. There we go. Alright. Alright, I'll take it. I'll take that L. Oh, Jesus. Another L. Come on. Need my stuff back, so let me call it over here. Get back! Headshot damage on the Brute Commander nowadays does get rid of them much, much quicker with the Flamethrower. Like, you will never like it's half a second or a second and their head is just popped. I feel like some of the units you don't have to care about the weak spot. Smaller ones. There's a few that's uh, going to be a good idea for you to do so. With these guys. Another big titan. <laughs> Bile titan. Bile titans are not ideal here for us. Because they're gonna... They make us waste a lot of time. And we require those 500 kilos.
And the other bad part is they end up team killing and taking my kills. <laughs> Don't want that. Let's see if I can get it to acid spit here. Crap. Come on. Do the spit move. Spit on me, you sucker. I think this rock is too low though. Let's see if it does it. No, the rock is too low. I don't think it's high enough for it to bounce back at him. Oh, out of fuel. Trying to get it to spit at itself. Try to show it to you guys. That's not going to do it. The other flamethrower is kind of low on ammo. Come on, resupply. Save the day. Come on. Oh, no. So close. How'd you like the taste of freedom? Come on, do this acid spit, you dickhead. That do it? Nah. Hmm. Considering actually just leaving it alone and leave. Oh, you know what? I'm getting the 500 kilos back. This should do. Oh, that's beautiful. Let's go. Oh, didn't actually intend to kill him there. I'm gonna call for your buddies. Exactly what I want. Let's go. Oh, that napalm is gonna do wonders. Let's freaking go, dude. Ow. Get you killed first. Cemetery in here. Oh crap, it's got MT. We didn't want that. We killed the bug breach a little bit too fast. All for those guys, and you know what? Not really gonna worry about that radar station. Want these guys to hopefully call for backup. You guys don't want backup? Call them for your little reinforcement. Come on, I'll wait for you guys. Ah, screw you guys then. Alright, we got a spore spewer up there. Let's see if we can make our way to the uh, bug nest I tagged earlier north side of the extraction zone off a little bit Looking good chip chip nah crap wish it was metals hells yes we got reinforcement boys not for me Come on, then. Where's the reinforcement at? All the way back there. That was a pretty bad napalm.
Hell yeah, call for your little buddy. <laughs> got a... Oh shit. Wanted to kill this brute commander, but not gonna work. At least we got rid of the charger there. Alright, start making our way there. Excuse me. Don't mind me. Alright, long way to go. Kill everything we can while we make our way there. Bug nests always have a crap ton of bugs for us to kill. Should bring us to fight off enough bugs till the end of the game. Yeah, that's gonna be gonna remain as a bit of a weakness to this loadout, to this build. Battle Titans. I had a pain in the ass. That fire was like pissing in the wind, dude. Give me medals, please. Oh, crap. Alright, not gonna worry too much about this Battle Titan. He's just gonna make us waste a lot of time. Uh, I want to use this Napalm Airstrike as soon as possible. Because I want my Eagle to rearm. I'm going to throw it. I'm going to try to throw it right inside the uh, bug nest, maybe. At 10 remaining. Either there or at the entrance of it. it. Yeah, that was pretty good. Yeah, that was actually solid. Alright, we can't do it much against this big guy. It's kind of... Crap. Oh no! Oh shit, we got kicked. Did the resupply do it? Nope. Alright. Only thing we've got left to do with this Bell Titan is going to be trying to get it to spit on itself. He died. What? I genuinely don't know how it died. There's no way he killed itself. What killed it? Whatever, I'm happy. Have a taste of democracy. Did it spit at itself? That's weird. I wonder if they can potentially spit on their own leg if they turn their head far enough. Oh crap. Oh, he had me. Come here, buddy. Burn them all! Dude, I am absolutely loving this ship module, dude. It is just tearing through them. And I think it's gonna be a better choice than the arc thrower hitting an extra enemy, too. Yeah, he's like all destroyed for some reason. I think he somehow spit on itself. Look at him. Guess you're just chilling there. Let me get rid of you before you actually manage to get out. Got another Battle Titan. God damn, how many Battle Titans have there been? Close a couple more holes. Hopefully that'll speed up the trolls even further. Cause we can. Oh shit. Okay, we're good. We're good. We could honestly take even a bit more of patrols. We can. We're still handling this quite fine. Oh my god. Okay, I thought I died. 100%. I thought I died. Come on, do the the spit again. Do you like I did your friend? Oh, that's good, right? Crap, still up. Oh, 
Ah, uh, still up. Oh, we got two of you now. God damn it. Okay, you take one. Your buddy already took one. You take this one now. Oh, crap. Hit me big time. I don't know if that was even good. Alright, it's gonna be hard to get them to spit on themselves, but what I can do is make each other spit on their friend. We can team kill rather- oh shit! Didn't even notice my health was going down. We can team kill rather than self kill. Oh my god. Where's the other resupply? I called it somewhere. Oh my god, that mine all got, almost got rid of me. Here somewhere. Let's go. Okay. More. Not getting much of a chance to burn them. Pressure is mounting up extremely hard. Do the spit, idiot. <laughs> it didn't work. Tried pissing them off, it didn't work. Crap, dude. I have a bad feeling. Oh my god, how am I alive? Go, inject again. I'm so dead. Oh my. Come on. Get some distance. Clip on this rock. Let's go. Kill it. Crap. Another group. Burn. The spit. The spit. Oh crap. That was almost on its friend's leg. Hundred kilos should be back any second now. How to do it with a flamethrower. Come on, buddy. Let me show you something. Come here. Oh, my God. No. <laughs> oh, no. This one, then. Yes. <laughs> he killed his friend. <laughs> Burn them all. Oh my god, we got another Bile Titan. Did I kill the Titan? I did. Let's go, dude. All of them. Holy crap. Let's go. Dude, we have killed so many freaking bugs. I'm starting to get real nervous. I have a good feeling. Even though this is not a bouncer world, or a pouncer world. Looking real solid. Empty. 
Although I think my previous record wasn't on a pounce of world either. Ah, oh, crap. I had the reload glitch. We see the uh, fuel tank. Oh crap. No more enemies. Let's look for more. Go a bit south there towards the uh, spore spewer. Maybe we can find a bit more of uh, a bit more of fighting. We have a minute left on the clock. And then the two minutes for the extraction. Oh. Dude, I am absolutely loving the flamethrower. It is just obliterating everything, dude. There is no threat that can take this on. You do, of course, lack in the uh, Bile Titan killing department, but other than that, wow, I am absolutely loving it. They make some fire resistant armor sets. I'm going to be the first one in line to equip it. Who's going to be there with me? Because this is lovely. I missed that napalm so bad. Crap. Rock. Down you go. Okay, let's go. We got groups here. 15 seconds on the clock. Oh, shit. Conveniently almost die there. Don't die yet. Gotta get a few more kills. Not gonna worry too much about just safely extracting. I'm just gonna continue killing everything on site. Let's see if we can kill all the bugs on this extraction. Problem is, I don't have... Yeah, the... I'm not going to be able to kill the Battle Titans anymore. I don't have 500 kilos anymore since the timer ran out. Get some, get the Battle Titans are... be a bit of an issue. Oh, oh crap. Oh, no. No, no, no. Get, get up. Get up. Yes, okay. It's so good, dude. It is so good. Have we seriously got three Battle Titans? That is not good. Two Battle Titans, actually. Crap, dude. I wanted little guys, not you big fellas. Dude, we actually wiped out the ex the extraction zone, with the exception of these annoying Battle Titans, of course. Come on. One more kills. Give me all you got! More kills. I want more kills. I don't want to extract. I want kills. Spit on itself. Don't work. Crap. You guys spit on each other for me? <laughs> Sounded wrong. Almost. They, all, they almost did. They almost spit on each other. More kills. Come here. Come here, dickhead. Oh, no! Ah. Well, that's a victory nonetheless. Let's just see how many kills we got. Boys, the flame damage is out of control, dude. It just absolutely crowd controls the hell out of the bugs, dude. Disappointing service. It was still a victory. What are you mad about? It is so, so powerful. It literally kills everything with extreme ease, with the exception, of course, of the Bile Titans. If you're in a group play, just have somebody that can handle the Bile Titans with... Ooh, 1,147. That is a personal record by over 100 kills. <laughs> yeah, if you're playing a group play, just have someone use the Quasar Cannon or Rail Cannon Strike and you're good to go. Thank you guys for watching. I'll be catching you boys on the next one. Peace!